Hi, welcome to the backyard of Pico de Gallo, where we take speed running hand care very seriously. So, if you want to speed run with the best of them, come a little closer and let Pico de Gallo show you the secrets of my three-step process. Beginning with step number zero. That's right, there's four steps in my three-step process. Step number zero is acknowledge that you need to take care of your most precious commodity, your speed running digits, okay? They need to be cared for, they need to be loved, these are delicate muscles in your body and you're, you're asking them to do incredible, crazy things. So, if you want to speed run with Maximum Guile, then you need to take care of your beautiful fingers. If you want the finger stretch of Dalzim, the mashing speed of Honda, the intimidating prowess of Zangief, then this process is for you. So, before you stretch your stuff on stream with your sonic boom, you stretch your fingers with sonic stretches. Demonstration. You take an action figure, you take a child. Not all figures work, okay? Take Pete Rose. Pete Rose has one posture. He won't work. Get him out of here! You take Darth Vader. Darth Vader is limited poses. He doesn't work. Get him out of here! Look at the movement. You ask the child, you say, child, form a figure with that figure. Once you have your figure in this pose, you take inspiration from the creativity of the mind of the child. And you work your fingers in the posture. You stretch and you become the greatest speed runner of all time. Dalzim, Dalzim stretching. And it's not just Dalzim. You can use any kind of soldier. Take this soldier. If you don't have a child, you just throw a soldier up. See how he has landed? And you feel the stretch. Sometimes I form my own poses. You just hold it. If your fingers can't get there on your own, use your other hand. It's an important process. Keep your fingers limber and they will work for you. Step number two. To achieve maximum guile, you take Pico de Gallo. Not to be confused with Pico de Gallo. Take the pico. You open the pico. You pour the pico. You take in the more pico. You pour in the more pico. Do that. You take your precious commodities. Stick them in the pico. This is such a simple, soothing uh, bath. For your hands. This can be done anywhere. You can be soaking your hands in pico while you're watching someone else's stream. You could be soaking your hands in pico while you're listening to the radio. There's no bad time to soak your hands in pico. They will thank you for it. If you find that if you find that the jalapenos burn your hands, quit crying and speed run. You wanna be fast? You work the Pico into your body and the Pico will work its way into you. So you might say to me, Pico, my life is too busy. I'm constantly moving around. I don't have time to sit here and soak my hands in Pico de Guile. I've got a solution for you. 
you take a glove, you pour in the pico. You take your hand, you put it in the glove. hear the solution working to improve the quality, the speed running power of your hands. Come in close so you can get this. You hear it? It's the sound of glory. See that drip down my forearm? It's a drip of glory. These hands will never move faster. Maximum Gaia!